All right, y'all. So right now we're in the mountains. We're gonna be looking for some uh, montane rattlesnake species out here in Arizona. So we'll see what we find. All right, let's go, y'all. So not too long after uh, I came here, the homie spotted this. First look at the banded rock rattlesnake. These are our protected species. So uh, fortunately, no manipulation. The vein type is allowed. But uh, yeah, but this one's pretty cool. I like the patterning on it. I don't like any rattlesnake I've ever I've ever seen. Super cool. All right, next animal caught. This uh, this little lizard. I'm actually not sure what the species is. I assume that the banded rock rock snakes like to eat a lot of these though. Check him out. Got some uh, where is it? Got some of that gold looking striping on his back. Yeah, we'll find. Put him back. All right, check this out. We got a much bigger. Uh, original raw snake. I just walked out almost on him. Pretty cool. Look at the camouflage on there. I think it's sick. Yeah, we're gonna. Yeah, we took a few pictures of him. Yeah. Let it be. It is such a nice snake. He's got that beautiful, beautiful back right there. That's awesome. Wow. What a snake, man. Second clobber I found. Pretty cool. I just wish he would be solid. I'm gonna do a wide angle on that. Go find a mountain king real quick, and then we'll do. All right, y'all. So right now we're just trying to find a, a big adult uh, banded rock rattlesnake. The ones we found are pretty cool, but I want to see a big one. So let's do it, guys. Uh, second banded rock we found. This one's greenish. Has some. Uh, Bit of a roast tint to it. Camera doesn't show it well, but look at this thing. He's super angry. One last look at this uh, banded rock raw snake. Cool. Slithering back. Next find, a funny lizard just caught by the homie. Oh, look at this thing. Sick. Good catch. Right after that, uh, Quark's funny lizard got this ornate tree lizard. Go on and go. I just caught this uh, lesser eos lizard. All right, I'll get eos lizard. Pretty cool, nice catch. Had to catch him along the uh, bank right here. Top of the mountain right now. I'm gonna be cruising for green rat snakes, heel monsters, you know, just whatever. Already got some pretty cool. Scopendra polymorpha. Ooh, I'm going to focus. Tiger centipede. Always like seeing these guys. Okay, uh, I guess first snake, uh, someone cruised by the homie. It's a little juvenile black tail rat snake. Pretty cool. We've seen uh, quite a few of these already, so. Nothing too crazy. Doing some uh, hiking on this wash. I got something really cool earlier on the road. I've got to record it, but I'll show you guys that later. For now, we got a little tarantula. I'll be honest, I'm not really sure of the species. I'll put, I'll probably put it in the description if I can, but yeah, pretty cool. Let's see what else we can find. Hopefully a coral snake. Next, uh, actually kind of cool find on a night, leaf cutter ants. I did know that these guys were found in the Southern US I was thinking, you know, maybe like Texas or something. But I'm in southern Arizona. I see these guys a lot in the tropics. So it's pretty cool seeing, you know, some uh, leafcutter ants in my own country. That's pretty cool, actually. Okay, next find is this flatty wall spider. I'm gonna see if I can uh, feed him, actually. Ooh, there you go. Look how fast that was. Kind of cool. Yeah, I was walking to this cactus and for a snake, got some diamond back. Pretty cool. Just want to get a quick size measure on this guy, so I can also give you guys a better look, but yeah, pretty cool Western Diamondback. I'm gonna put him back right now. Just a quick look, and yeah, there we go. Ooh, like a big cow bone or something. Like a femur. I'm thinking maybe it'll make like a femur. Oh, creepy. Nah, not really. Let's keep going. Okay, second snake found this uh, Western Diamondback cross snake. I'm not really gonna try to serve him. 
This is probably about another good uh, two foot snake. Sorry, not two foot, three foot. Maybe three and a half. He seems a little bit longer than the last one. Uh, I mean, I'm glad I've seen snakes, but I've seen these guys quite a few times now. So, not really the coolest thing. But hey, you know, a snake is a snake. Joe, so as promised, I'm going to show you the really cool thing that we caught yesterday. This animal, we're just gonna keep him for just like, you know, one day, only to film some, uh, you know, film some videos and take some photographs. And he's gonna be, be he's gonna be put right back. But check this out. This is the giant desert centipede, skull pendra heros. Look at this thing. I've been wanting to catch one of these animals like ever since I heard about them. They're so cool. I caught them yesterday as we were, uh, we was road cruising. So I just picked them up, you know, put them in a little bottle. Make sure it's kept dry because these centipedes, you know, they're a hot desert dwelling species. So, you know, they like dry conditions, especially the ones out in Arizona. So, yeah, just, you know, I'm actually going to try and release them today because like, we caught them yesterday. But, yeah, super cool animal. Look at this thing. This thing's a monster. But, yeah, nah, I'm definitely about to make hella videos off this dude. This honestly, I don't know, for me, this kind of beats the banded rock rouse thing, because, like, I will, I will really like arthropods, especially big ones. This guy's good at least, like, I want to say at least seven inches, maybe six and a half. They can get up to, like, you know, eight, you know, nine, even ten inches long. These are the biggest, these are the largest centipede species in the United States, so. Super cool. Look at those fangs. And apparently, they have a very painful bite, so. Don't worry, I'm playing it safe. Yeah, look at the orange antenna, black head, orange body, yellow legs, and those last three segments are also black with a pair of orange terminal legs. Super cool. Okay, first animal spotted, still tarantula. Very cool. All right, guys, first thing cruise, we got this uh, black tail rattlesnake. Pretty good size of adult, look at that. Okay, second snake found this uh, juvenile black neck garter. I found him crawling as we were trying to handle the rattlesnake situation. Super cool. Ah, uh, well, uh, there was our second rock tail rattlesnake, but it uh, escaped. It's down there somewhere. All right, third uh, or fourth snake found this little tiger rattlesnake. Look at him. Okay, uh, next animal caught, this Sonoran Desert Toad. Be free, Mr. Uh, Sonoran Desert Toad. Yeah. All right, quick meet up with uh, all the group that we were going with. We'll see if we find more snakes, but yeah, pretty cool. All right, so the girl that we're with, Valerie, she wants to see a red spotted toad. So I'm gonna prank her. Oh, hold on, there's, there's like a weird bug on your head. Oh God. Hold on, hold on, hold on let me get him off. Whoa, look at this Jesus bug. Jesus, go <laughs> hey, Here's your red spotted toad. <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh my God, I, you scared the f*** out of me. <laughs> Whoa. First red spotted toad, any words to say? Um, such a cutie. Hal. Okay, uh, first lizard caught today. Oh, Cork spiny lizard. This is a fairly decent sized individual. Pretty cool. Let's go find some more. All right, let's go, y'all. So right now we're just photographing the uh, this black tail rattlesnake that I found. We're just gonna be getting some photographs of him, and then we're gonna be putting him back in the tub temporarily, and we're gonna release him right back where he found him. So yeah, let's do it. All right, y'all. First king snake found of the trip. Look at this thing. This is a Mexican black king snake. <laughs> Pretty yeah, cool. So you don't even have to do that. Wait, so why do we keep them? Yeah, this thing is sick. Fucking Dan Wells, man. <laughs> Would you do that? Hell no, dude. He said fucking Dan Wells. I got penis size compared to him. I'm not doing white anymore, I'm doing macro. All right, y'all doing some photography. I got the uh, giant desert sun right here, and we got a Mexican black king snake right here. Arizona stuff. Whose hat is this? That's mine. Oh, okay. Yeah. What do you got in there? Blue jay feather? Yep. Right. You know, all these guys, but I have not caught a single one. So finally got one. 
Uh, someone just flipped them, so this is a uh, desert grass whiptail. Uh, Sonoran. Sonoran. Sonoran, I mean. Cool. All right, let's get y'all right now. We're just, uh, about to go, I'm about to head to bed. Um, you know, we've had a long day uh, ahead of me, so I'm going to see if I can wake up, you know, and get four hours, a massive four hours of sleep. Uh, and we're going to get up and try and look for some vine snakes in the morning. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna uh, you know, get some Z's. And yeah, we'll see what we find tomorrow in the morning. Come on. Classic. <laughs> yeah, I see why they're called Mexican black king stick right now. In the daylight, the black really like pops out. <laughs> okay, first find while hiking this canyon. This little assassin bug. Very ornate looking. Oh, there he goes. Got a sunbird's diving beetle right here. I just netted him in this water. Pretty neat. Oh, there you go. There's a focus on. Check it out. Okay, got a little uh, water boatman right here. These are predatory insects. They actually, one of them actually just bit me. But yeah, I got a couple more in the net. He's swimming backwards. Watch. I'll show you right now. I don't know if you can see that, but. They like swing backwards basically in the water. Yeah, there's one right there. And another one down there. I'm really I'm gonna release these two right here though. That I got. Okay, got this uh Chiricolin leopard frog. After uh several attempts getting a boot wet and dropping my phone in the water, but eh, pretty cool. I'd say it's worth it. As long as my phone isn't totally uh effed over. Guys, so we just uh cruised this Norn Gopher snake. Look at this thing. This is way better looking than the one that we caught. Way cooler too. So we're gonna bag him temporarily and then return right back where we found him. All right, vine snake hunt unsuccessful. So right now we're doing some uh, photography with this Norn gopher snake. I have a giant desert centipede eating a striped tail scorpion. I'm pretty sure this is a striped tail on my hand right now. I'm having a lot of fun right now, so. Okay, uh, next snake that was found by the other group. This is Norn whip snake. Probably a medium sized one. This thing's pretty cool. First time seeing one. Yeah. Hey, goodbye to Arizona. There's a gopher snake that right. skipped up in the tree. Last snake of the day. We got the whip snake right there. Heading back to California. It was a fun trip to Arizona, but. And a black tail right there. We gotta go. Yeah, let's get going. Alright, what's good, y'all? So, right now, I'm actually at my college dorm. I apologize for the poor lighting. This is the least noisy place I could find. But yeah, it's been about, you know, two weeks since I departed Arizona. It was hella fun. I'm definitely down to running back like next year. You know, we gotta get the brown vine stink, you know, get a vinegar rune. But yeah, you know, super fun trip. You know, I spent hella money on it, but I don't regret a single bit of it. So uh, yeah, you know, thanks for tuning in and I'll see y'all next time, all right? And stay on the lookout for more uh, vlogs like this. Got it on.